Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to hopefully resolve if your external USB mouse is not working properly on your laptop. So this should hopefully be a pretty straightforward process here guys. And without further ado, let's go ahead and jump straight into it. First thing I recommend doing would be to open up the search menu and search for device manager. Best result should come back with device manager. Go ahead and open that up. You want to double click on the mice and other pointing devices category in here. Double click on it. And then right click on each mouse or mice that's listed in here, each one at a time. And then you want to update the driver. Select browse my computer for drivers. And then select, let me pick from a list of available drivers on my computer. I recommend selecting the default one that it suggests. If there's a manufacturer specific one, I recommend going along with that one. But generally, you guys kind of get the gist here. You want to install or update the drivers. So go ahead and select next. Again, you would go down the list and update those drivers respectively if there are additional ones in here. And then hopefully that would resolve the problem. Something else we can try here as well would be to close out of here and open up the search menu, type in control panel. Best match should come back with control panel. Go ahead and open that up. And you want to set the review by up in the top right to large icons and then select power options from this list. And then you want to go versus change plan settings and go ahead and select that. And then select change advanced power settings. And now that we're in here, you want to expand the USB settings and click the little plus sign after that. And then click the plus sign after USB selective suspend setting. Anything in here, you want to go ahead and disable it. So if it's currently enabled, you want to disable that. And then select apply and OK. And then once that's done, just close out of here. And you may need to restart your computer, but that should really be about it at this point. And you can always try a different mouse as well. You might have an issue with your actual mouse hardware. Mice are pretty cheap. You might need to go buy a new one. So, you know, it happens. They should be replaced every so often. So pretty straightforward process, guys. I do hope I was able to help you out. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.